Hey guys, it's John, and today I am playing Bloodborne. This is a game that I bought five and a half years ago, and I never played it very far. I'll get to that in a second. Um, this is going to be a largely blind playthrough. I've only seen two bosses in the entire game. I don't know anything about the rest of it. And I thought I'd do something a little different with my channel this year. And what better way to start off 2021 with a playthrough of this game. Okay, so here's the deal. As you can see from my PlayStation trophies, I beat Father Gascoigne and the Cleric Beast uh, in 2015, but that's as far as I've ever gotten with this game. And I don't even really remember it. Uh, I played a couple hours of this game. I played a couple hours of the first Dark Souls, a couple hours of Sekiro, but I never really got into any of them. I never really enjoyed them, I guess. It, it wasn't that they were too hard. That wasn't why I stopped. It's just, it felt like it took forever to get anywhere in these games. But I think I'll be motivated to play this through to completion if I do a YouTube playthrough of it. So that's what this is. And maybe I'll enjoy myself as I get further into the game. For those of you who don't know anything about Bloodborne, I don't know much more than you do, to be honest. I know it was created by From Software, who are famous for creating the Souls series, Demon Souls, Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. And this game came out as a PS4 exclusive in 2015. People have told me that this game is a lot more horror focused than their other games. And they say that there's a lot of Lovecraftian elements. It's got a great atmosphere, awesome creature design. So I'm eager to see it. I'm eager to jump straight into this with you guys and check it out. I do have a couple of conditions as well as a promise. I, John Wolf, solemnly swear as of the uploading of this part one video, that I will do to the best of my ability to complete Bloodborne on the channel in video form as a full playthrough. With the only exception to that promise being, and here's where the conditions come in, if the playthrough ever becomes unfun for me for reasons outside of the game, I reserve the right to stop it. To avoid this situation from occurring, I would just ask that everyone calm down. I know that the Souls community is very passionate, often to a fault, and I don't want this to become a series where anyone gets frustrated watching the videos. It's not the purpose of them. The purpose is to be fun, not only for me, but for you. So I would just ask that you please take a deep breath. If you see me doing something wrong, if you, because I'm gonna do a lot of things wrong in this game. I'm not gonna be very good at it. That's okay, right? This is all for fun. Just take a deep breath. If you see me doing something that frustrates you calmly and nicely, please tell me things that I can improve on. I would appreciate constructive criticism because I'm going to need it in this game. I don't think this is something that I'm going to be able to just bully through on my own. So I will be looking at the comments for tips and suggestions, but please be nice and calm and loving when you write me your constructive criticism. Now that all that sentimental craps out of the way, let's get into the game. Okay, so I know that you can play this game online, but I like I don't know these type of things. Doesn't that mean that people can like invade your game and stuff? I don't really want that, so I'm gonna select play offline. I assume this is something that I can change later. And we're gonna start off with a new game. Let's go. Oh yeah. Pale blood. Well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of Yarnum blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. Are you me from the future? Is that the twist? I already figured it out. That's my character in the future. Somehow there's two. Okay, character customization. <laughs> I'm not really gonna care too much about this. I'm gonna go super basic, but I'm not gonna do default. I've got a great idea. We're gonna name our character Guy. That's a, that's a, That was a common name a couple centuries ago, wasn't it? Was it? I don't know. Uh, yeah, gender, male, age, young. What? What does age look like? No thanks. Yeah, young, thank you. Origin, milk toast, ordinary happy upbringing, all attributes average. Lone survivor of lost Hamlet, 
High life essence and vigor. I have no idea what that means. Troubled childhood. Suffered misfortune in youth. Highly resilient as a result. So what changes when I... Okay, so you get more endurance when you pick that one. And you get fewer blood echoes. You get less vitality. Less strength. But more skill. I don't know. This is not... This is not a decision that I'm equipped to make. Violent past. Terribly violent past. Rash, but stronger for it. Born specialist. Fit for sleuthing or academia. Experienced in war. A soldier with strength and skill. Scion to a respectable line with faith in your pedigree. Faced terrible hardships, but now confident in your purpose. I feel like that description could be used for like three other backgrounds here. Waste of skin. You are nothing. Talentless. You shouldn't have been born. Okay, I, I get that this is an origin that you want to pick if you're bored of the game, if you've beaten it like five times, and you want a harder playthrough, right? Well, we're not picking that. In the interest of keeping my first playthrough as vanilla as possible, I'm going to go with Milk Toast. I don't necessarily... I know that there's some origins that may give me an easier time on a first playthrough, but I don't necessarily want an easier time. I just want to experience the, you know, basic... Bloodborne experience that most people have on their first playthrough without uh, additional information. Now we can change our appearance. Here we go. Uh... Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, that sure. <laughs> Don't want to hear what the other ones sound like. Do I? Let's hear them. Sounds like the Oblivion Guards. Oh! Damn, Pale Blood is right. Holy crap. Uh, does he like burn up if the sunlight touches him? Let's go there, I guess. Oh my god, I went to load favorite, and apparently I made this character five years ago. This is a weird case of the past clashing with the present. Yeah, let's go with this guy. He looks kind of like how I used to when I had hair. Okay, that's not, that made me sound really old. Um, this is great. Let's finish. Okay, I, I'm ready to finalize my contract. Get me in there. Blood gem workshop tool. Uh, I'm sure this will be relevant later, but I, I'm not sure I even had time to read it. Madman's knowledge. Skull of a madman touched by the wisdom of the great ones, used to gain insight. Cool. If I come across it, I'll keep that in mind. Good. All signed and sealed. Now, let's begin the transfusion. Oh, don't you worry. The transfusion? Whatever happens, you may think it all a mere bad dream. Are you gonna give me, like, special blood? That's where the title of the game comes from! <laughs> Bloodborne! Are you doing okay, bud? Maybe you need a transfusion. Hey, where'd he go? Hello thing rising out of the pool of blood. Oh, this is a werewolf. Okay, I remember this thing. How'd I do that? First boss defeated. Keep that thing away from me. This chameleon looking ass, get out of here. No, not you either. What, are you just gonna gum in my face like that? Ah, you found yourself a hunter. 
It's Yusefka's clinic. I know how to pronounce Yusefka at least, so I'm not completely green. Okay, so this is, here, here's me, look! There I am, I got a hood on. That wasn't part of the customization. All right, uh, well, well, let's just explore here. Let's inspect this. Handwritten scrawl, seek pale blood to transcend the hunt. Okay, what? Let's open this door, I guess. Great. All right. So I can't help but notice that I'm unarmed right now. View notes. Oh, hello. Oh, those are those things that were gumming at me on the bed, on the gurney. R1, attack, right hand weapon. Thank you so much for the tip, little ones. I unfortunately don't have a weapon though. Can I get a tip for where I could find a weapon? Is there, are they here too? Oh, they are. Man, it's like whack-a-mole. They gotta just transport from hole to hole with a little piece of parchment to give me a tip. R3, lock on, release target. Okay, so it's like, I got that. It's like Z fighting. I played Ocarina of Time. Um, hmm. Can't help but notice there's no weapon. Hi. Let's see. Oh, there's blood right here. That sounds like... Oh! There's werewolf here. Yeah, I remember this werewolf. I don't remember very much from my first, uh... First attempt at this game, but I remember this guy. Hi, bud. So... Okay, you're kind of busy. You're kind of busy eating. Does that mean I can... Does that mean I can freely pass? Or no? He looks like he kind of stopped eating. Maybe if I go back? No, he looks like he's awaiting my arrival. I don't like that. Okay, it was nice meeting you uh, again, but uh, if you don't want a taste of my burning hand again, you best back off. I think he knew. I think he knew that I was the one that... Oh, it does not open from this side. Oh, I wish I had tried that door first. Okay, so if I don't have a weapon... Wow, you just backhand them, huh? Ooh, he's a Karen. Let me speak to the manager. Whoopa! All right, if you know what's good for you, you're gonna let me pass. Thanks. What's, oh, I was gonna view a note. Oh, you did not let me view that note. That's right, I'm immune while opening the door. Oh, I'm not immune anymore. Hey, what's up? Restore HP, use blood vial. <gasps> okay, well, do I have any of that? Oh, I don't have any. Oh, that sucks. Hey, you don't, you know where you store any weapons around here? Maybe you got some in here? No? Maybe, is there one back here, perhaps? Did you kill me? He killed me. You died. Bro, this game is so punishing. It throws you unarmed into a locked room against a werewolf that kills you in three hits. This Bloodborne's brutal. Well, yeah, if I had a sword, that thing would have been dead. Oh, you're supposed to die. Okay, I thought that was a legit death, but it's a, it's a plot death. You guys really gotta make that groaning sound every time you appear? Fine, I'll check out the headstone if you're so insistent on it. Awaken at a selected location in Yarnum. Is that where I just was? No, 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 okay. No, 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 no. I, I don't, I'm not sure I wanna go there right now. An abandoned doll. Mmm. Just a normal... Non-sentient doll, you say. Accept gift from messengers. The messengers offer you a trick weapon. Choose one. Trick weapons are wielded with the right hand and employed in beast hunting. Okay, so I can choose the saw cleaver, the hunter axe, or the threaded cane. I think I'll go with the saw cleaver. That looks cool. Sure. 
And they took the rest away. Unbelievable. Okay, I'm still using my backhand. How do I switch to arms? Saw cleaver. Okay, so I've got it. I've got it out now. Check it out. Yeah, that werewolf wouldn't stand a chance. He's running scared now. Okay, so that's like, okay. So this is like a quick attack, like a fast attack, and this is like a strong attack. And if I hold it down, okay, that makes sense. Whoa, right. Okay, I think I've actually used the saw cleaver before. I remember this, this little maneuver. Hmm, so this gives me more range, but less power, I'm guessing is the compromise. That would make sense. The messengers offer you a firearm. Choose one. Firearms are wielded with the left hand and employed in beast hunting. Okay, so we can choose hunter pistol or hunter blunderbuss. I'm gonna go with blunderbuss. Blunderbusses are cool. Thanks guys. Why not just give me both? Being so stingy. Wait, we don't. This hunter blunderbuss. All right, cool. So if I remember, nope, that's not it. Is it, oh, okay. So that's left trigger that did that. Nice. Okay, so let's say I wanted to shoot the hell out of you guys. They're immune to gunfire. All right. I mean, pff, look at us, we are intimidating. Hi guys, uh, you got any more? Except gift from messengers. A notebook received from the messengers. Leave messages with these loyal servants to share them with hunters in other worlds. Okay, so I got a notebook, nice. So now do I close? Oh, all right. That's totally fine, I didn't want to go in there anyway. What's this? He's taking a bath! Look, oh, he... Bath messenger, that makes sense. Trade in blood echoes with messengers to buy and sell items. Unfortunately, I don't have any blood echoes. I think you get blood echoes from killing things. Unfortunately, I haven't killed anything yet. Except myself. Um, I just kind of walked into a room and let a werewolf maul me to death. What was this? Final ritual altar. A holy chalice is required to conduct a ritual. Okay. Fifth ritual. Oh, how many, so there's, so there's six in total and they all require a holy chalice. I remember that. Makeshift altar. A short ritual root chalice is required to conduct a ritual. That's a mouthful. That doesn't really roll off the tongue. So what's down here? How big is this place? Dude. View notes. <laughs> After taking damage from an enemy, there's a period of time in which attacking the enemy in return will restore a certain amount of your HP. Okay, so you get lifesteal from a counterattack, basically. R1, when next to staggered enemy, visceral attack. Oh, okay, I called it a fast attack, my bad. It's called a visceral attack. We gotta get the terminology right. Hi. Shooting your firearm will interrupt and stagger an enemy when properly timed to their attack. Oh God, okay. Hitting an enemy from behind with a charge attack causes them to stagger. I see. And it is called a strong attack, but if you hold it, it's called a charge attack. Okay, so this, charge attack, strong attack, Visceral attack. I gotta say the visceral attack, not very visceral. Doesn't really live up to the name. L1, transform weapon, transforming attack. So that's this. Emergency quicksilver bullet replenishment. Used with caution, performing this action drains HP. Okay. So can I use it here though? Boom, plus five. Oh, but my health went down. Plus five. So, huh. That little yellow circle up there lights up. I wonder why that is. Switch weapons. 
Oh. Oh, so I, okay, but I, I want them out. Thank you. All right, I'll remember that. Hello. <laughs> Square, use item, and then down is to toggle item. I don't have any items. That's the only problem with that. Hello, come on. Chop, chop. <laughs> so O is to run. Ooh, look at me go. This is way faster. But you do have a stamina bar. And the stamina bar is also, I noticed, used up when you attack. And trusting your notes with the messengers will allow hunters from other worlds to read your words. So with that in mind, would it be better to play online? The notes held by messengers contain the written wit and wisdom of hunters from other worlds. Okay. Well, I think these hunters from other worlds were the developers. So you're not really mystifying me there. Assist the hunters of other worlds by using the small resonant bell. So I guess that's how we can play with other people online. Receive assistance from the hunters of other worlds by using the beckoning bell. Oh, okay. So you can call other people to help out in your game if you play online. Or you can enter their games if they have one of those bells. Or if you have one of those bells. Okay, I think I'm... I think I'm good. I'll, I'll talk to you. Talk to you later. You surely sentient doll. Okay, so let's go to the first floor sick room in Yarnum, I guess. And I don't know where this is. Is that where I originally woke up? Pebble. Small pebbles can be found throughout Yarnum. You can throw them at enemies, and they're quite thrilling, apparently. Whoa, I don't remember this many of you guys being out here. What about you? Oh, now you tell me about the back step. So... So you tap circle to back step like that, and then if you, you're moving around, it's a roll. Wow, that seems kind of... Okay, yeah, yeah, I figured that out. I figured out how to shoot my blunderbuss. Options, open menu. Okay. Which I, I figured that out on my own too. So is uh, is Mr. Werewolf still here? He is. Okay, okay. So should we try to kill him? Is there any disadvantage in this game to dying over and over again? When locked onto a target, you will quick step instead of rolling. Oh, so you never... Okay, so I'm locked onto him. Oh, look. He hasn't even had that much health. Okay, so... Okay, that wasn't bad. I mean, he was really weak. Three blood vials. I killed my first werewolf, and now I'm stomping around on him as his body flails on the ground before me. So who are you eating? I think I think he was eating the guy in the wheelchair. Yeah. How'd you get in here? You weirdo. What's this? Oh, he had two blood vials. So I have five blood vials, and I think those are for healing. I don't think I need to heal just yet, but it would be nice. Oh, okay, thank you. That was actually perfectly timed. Great job, guys. I, I have to say, small nitpick, I am disappointed that walking on the broken glass doesn't create any sound. All right. Look out, world, I just defeated my first enemy. So, yeah, watch out. Who knows how many of you I will defeat in turn. So do we go out this way? Closed by a device. All right, that's not very specific. It sounds like there's something big back there. What device would you say is closing this? Maybe a lock? Do I have to get a key for it? All right, well, I'll be on the lookout for a key. Hello. 10 Quicksilver bullets. Okay, so that's for the blunderbuss. I think I was using up ammo earlier when I was shooting mindlessly in the afterlife. Or in between life? Boy, that took forever. Maybe it's time to work out a bit more. You won't struggle with an iron gate like that. 
Oh my god. This poor horse. Died doing its worldly duties. He said duty. Hmm. Well, this place is uh, pretty cool. Hi. Four blood vials. Okay, so I got nine heals. Nice. Okay. I guess... Well, this is blocked off, and there's no way to go down there, so I guess you just gotta go up here. Oh! Hello! That's right. That's what I thought. Man, he just attacked me without a second thought. But I guess this is the kind of place this is, huh? Can't trust anyone. Oh, dude. Okay. So I got I got him... I got him pretty quickly. Oh. Dude. Okay. So how much do these heal if I use one? Okay, so it heals about that much. Hmm. So I gotta like, uh, when I'm in a situation like that and they're trying to hit me, it's probably best to like roll around them. But if you're locked on like I was, you can't roll. You have to backstep. Isn't that what it said? All right. Closed by a device. Very specific, thank you. I feel so informed. Exhaustive insight. Let's... Well, where can we go? Wait, there's something... Ah! Ah! Out of my way. There's something here. Six Molotov cocktails. Dude, why did you have six Molotov cocktails? Maybe it's a good thing you're dead. How did you die without using those? You look like you got backed up into a corner or something. Whoa, there were skulls? There were skulls in this random box. <laughs> can I open these? No, these are like metal. It's only if they're wooden that I can smash them open. Oh, 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 crank. This is the fabled device. Oh, I, I, I thought it was gonna open up the gate. Well, this'll do. Oh my god. What the hell? I don't want to see your beard, dude. I want to see behind me. What was that? Maybe I disturbed someone's slumber. What is this? Light lamp. Okay. This lamp now transports you back to the hunter's dream. That's the little afterlife place. Upon death, you will awaken at this lamp. Okay. Well, I don't want to just return. Just yet. Hello? There is someone coughing. Does not open from this side. Oh, so it's like a shortcut that you can open? Who is coughing? I just want to talk. <laughs> Possibly kill you. I got eight pebbles. Okay. So how do I switch, let's see, quick items. So let's th throw, let's see, Molotov cocktail, round pebbles that can be thrown at targets. <laughs> okay, so now I can cycle through these. Molotov cocktail, pebble. Let's have the pebble out. I don't want to accidentally throw a Molotov cocktail because I don't know what I'm doing. Potentially disastrous. Hello. Okay. Okay. All right. Hmm. So I don't... If it wasn't clear there, I don't really know how to fight. <laughs> I 
That was just one dude. Imagine if there were like five of those. I would have been in big trouble. Is there any way to like stealth? Can I walk like this? Oh, that guy's not dead. Oh, but this guy has a shield. So this guy on the left has a shield. I should probably like try to take him out, right? Okay, did I kill him? Okay, okay. I'm actually gonna heal real quick, okay? Did I, okay, these guys are, these guys are chumps. I, I should be beating the shit out of these guys. Oh no, okay, I, we'll hold off on going down there and <laughs> just, is there anything, is there any other uh, possible route I can go? Well, hmm. What are they looking for? Are they looking for me? By any chance? I, uh, something makes me think they want to kill me. Okay. Who else is down here? Just this guy? What was he burning? Oh, it's okay. You didn't hear shit, did you? Destroyed. Stealth killed. Okay, so what? Oh, this is just, oh, you just burned a dude at the stake and you were just standing next to it awkwardly. I see. What's this, knock? Are you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Okay, well, who said I want anything to do with you? Okay? You're not so great either. What happens if I knock again? Are you that outsider? We already had this conversation. Oh, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Hmm. That outsider. Okay, so I'm known around these parts. My reputation precedes me. Okay, I just robbed uh, a corpse of some necessary. Funds. I, li I like just whacking stuff. There's nothing inside the objects that I'm callously destroying, but it kind of makes me feel better. Oh, shh. They could hear us. I don't think I can handle that mob just yet. Uh, but there's two guys right here. Okay, so what happens? What happens if I... Oh, there they go. That guy's got a rake. Is that like a... So what happens if I just... Whoa! How powerful were you? We'll never know. Okay, so those guys are patrolling the streets. Hello. Lads, you've come on. You don't open the door on the night of the hunt. Away with you, now. The night of the hunt. I see. Where are they hunting? Are they hunting me? Hello. You have a... Oh my god. He has a gun, dude. Whoa, it's a good thing he was a heavy sleeper. He was about to shoot me, I think. Um, I heard you. Oh wait, no look. Look, 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 look. There's, over there, there's a dude. There's a dude, he, he thinks he's gonna ambush me. Okay. Now that's funny. Oh, look, look, oh, you can see his sickle. Yeah, I knew you were there. Hello, try to make it less obvious next time, idiot. Bloodstone shard, what does that do? How do I get to the, okay. Bloodstone shot. Embed in weapon to fortify. Okay, so used or just, oh, you don't use it right now. Okay, so I, I guess I don't use it right now, or? Embed in weapon to fortify, if it wants to. That's what that should read, because 
I tried to use it just now. Or maybe this isn't the place that I use it. Okay. Okay, that didn't, uh, all right, all right. Let's see. What are your attack patterns? He called me a foul beast. Okay, I'm not getting a, a ton of like tactical experience because I'm just one-shotting these dudes with this uh, charged attack. Okay, look, there they are, see? Oh, wait, did he just see me? Oh no, I was supposed to be stealthy. Well, let's just walk on like, uh, like nothing happened and maybe... Oh no, he's, he, he's, he's staring at me. Oh, but he's like, hey, wait up. <laughs> hey, wait up, friend. All right, so this looks, ooh, they're burning a werewolf guy. Huh. The night of the hunt, so are they hunting werewolves? Why are they hunting me, am I a werewolf? What? Oh, damn, okay. Um, I'm sorry. I was gonna just go stealth kill that guy, but... Okay, okay. Okay, how about this? How about this? How about that? Oh, you didn't see that coming, did ya? Did ya? Did ya, did ya, did ya? Yeah, that's right. Jog on. Wow, they just came right on up here. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a few still there. And that guy that was on patrol over there is still hanging out. Is there any way that I can like aim the Molotov cocktail? Cause I'd love to do that. I just want to get this guy's stuff. Quicksilver bullets. Okay. So what, what's this guy doing? He's just kind of, he's just kind of standing there. Are you going to go in? When will he turn around? Okay, I'm just going to. Oh. Oh, what? What was that? How do I do that again? Man, it, it was kind of your own fault. You just kind of stood here and stared at the gate. Easy pickings. Okay, so let's see. I can drop down here. I don't think that that's really in my best interest. There's a lot of these guys. I'm not sure if I want to go that way just yet. Um, Especially since like the street continues this way and I haven't gone down it. <laughs> A path of destruction behind me. Oh, 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 we don't wanna, we don't want them to. So this guy's a werewolf too, huh? Okay, okay. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I think, I think one of them saw me. No, no, no. Didn't. I could probably Molotov cocktail these guys. Am I wasting these Molotov cocktails, by the way? Look, they're all grouped up. They're just, just begging for it. Let's go. Hey, look. What if I what if I try to blend in, like an Assassin's Creed? Hey, I'm part of the crew. Oh uh, yeah, let's go hunt these guys, dude. Oh no, that only got one of them. Ow. Okay. All right. All right. I'll fight you. I'll fight you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're low. You're low. Ow. Okay. Here's the shield guy that was mean mugging me earlier. Okay, my first battle against the shield guy. Okay. You'll mess up my brains, he says, dead on the floor. What was that? <laughs> Dude, I don't think you're gonna be messing up anybody. 
lying horizontal like that. Okay, so, what's over here? I need, oh look, there's another thing being burned on a cross here. Uh, what is that? No thanks. Okay, you know what? Maybe I don't gotta, you know, explore every single crevice of this place. Hmm, but then again, if I don't fight, what kind of a, what kind of a, oh, here we go. Operate device. Oh, and we're back. We're back here. Let me through. Wow. Yeah, okay, right by the ladder. Got it, so it's a shortcut. Okay. Um, yeah, let's keep going then. Do I fight this guy? Okay, I'm gonna fight this guy. I'm gonna lose. I just wanna see what's over here. Will you get out of my way? Okay, okay, shh, 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 stealth. What are you guarding exactly? Like, what's over here? You don't really have a whole lot of time to like, charge attack this guy. Hmm. So. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, you're really strong. Holy shit, you're really, you're really strong. Oh, you're really strong. I mean, I figured, but this is the Bloodborne experience. Throwing knife, okay. Does not cause a great deal of damage to beasts, but with deft use can distract attackers and keep them at bay. Hmm, I haven't been using my gun at all. Okay, so I'm back at this. Hello. But I lost all of my blood echoes. Oh, you gotta kill them all over again. Oh, uh, okay, we gotta get a little quicker at this then. Okay. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so, but then you know, you know where everybody is. You know where everybody is, so it like gives you a, oh my god, okay, so it gives you like something of an advantage knowing where they are, right? <laughs> it cracks me up that he just has no idea. He just has no idea that you're right here just smacking the shit out of him. So is this, what I want to know, is this open? So this stays open. Acquire blood echoes. Oh, this is where I died. And you get your blood echoes back. Okay, yeah, I'm not messing with you again until I'm like way stronger. I'll, I'll see you, buddy. So then with that in mind, hello. Okay, I was a little slow on the take there. Oh, you still got me with the torch. So with that in mind, can you just like farm blood echoes? Is that a thing in this game? I gotta be careful with my blood vials. I'm kind of using them up. I'm using up a lot of them actually. I should probably calm down with that. Oh. Yeah, you're not the only one that's got a gun. I forgot that you were even there. Holy shit. But yeah, is that a thing in this game to like farm? Farm blood echoes? Cause you can multiply them then. Cause I'm earning new ones and I also am getting my old ones from the people I've already killed. 
Oh my god. What a horrible death. I just forgot that you were there. So, okay, here's a question that I think is going to be answered on this next respawn. Do they always patrol the same routes, stand at the same locations? Like, there's very little variance to it, I would guess. Like, this guy's going to come crashing through here. There he is. So a lot of this game is just going to be at least, you know, not the boss fights, but just the regular gameplay is going to be memorization. Just memorizing where people are, how far away you have to be in order to hit them, that kind of thing, right? Oh, hello friends. Okay, I'm gonna hold off on the Molotov cocktails. Okay, Rake guy, I haven't fought you yet. But you're not really impressing me. Okay, Rake guy's just another dude. I thought, <laughs> their friends are just like, yeah, whatever. Oh, my bad. So you can be pretty casual with these guys. They're... Okay. Maybe not that casual. <laughs> you, mean, you can be pretty casual with these guys, though. Like, they're not gonna... be tough to beat. And I would imagine, after a certain point... Excuse you? At a certain point of, like, upgrades, they'd be even easier. Because you can upgrade in this game, right? I would assume. Blood Echoes retrieved. So your Blood Echoes from your previous death aren't located at the exact location of where you died. Oh my god. Okay, so you gotta be a little bit further away on that guy. <laughs> that was a fun little dodge I did. I mean, it worked out. and I'm not like... I'm not an amazing Bloodborne player yet, but that was fun. Hello, sir. Why do you just stand? Why do you just stand at the gate? It's so weird. Why do you do that? Also, how do I get this gate to come up? Hmm. Okay, I guess we gotta get across here. This seems to be the only way to go, is right here. So... That guy's got a gun over there, I'm keeping my eye on him. Huh. See, okay, okay, so he's got quite the range with that gun. But you can see the projectile. And he was hitting the fences just now. And he's just gonna stand there, okay. I'm thinking, okay, here's my strategy. I'm gonna pick these two dudes off, look. They're starting to patrol, or... Oh no, they're just going up there, okay. Hmm. Cause fighting these guys with a rifle dude in the background is not gonna be what I want to do. So, maybe I'm gonna go up here first, or maybe I can, I think I can bait these guys. And not activate these other dudes. Like, look, hey rake guy, torch guy. Oh, oh, there's another gun guy. He gave up pretty quick. Oh, he, no, he's, he's still shooting at me. Okay, shoot again. Oh, I dodged you. Okay, one gun guy. Wow, okay. So this side's open. This side's open over here. 
Okay, so I got that. I don't need to kill every single enemy. I can just... Okay, what's through here, though? It sounds like there's like a big something. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna leave you to it. You get through there, they gotta deal with you. Sounds like a great deal to me. Oh, there's another... I want this. Bloodstone shard. I need to know what to do with those. It says you can use them on your weapon. Oh wait, you were the dead body that I got the stuff off of. My bad. Oh. There's lots of cackling and merriment coming from here. I don't reckon you're from around here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Oh, you poor, poor thing. <laughs> you know, it's really not so bad so far. Just wait till I get in there. You guys ain't gonna be laughing so much when I get in there. A baby crib, ooh. Baby shouldn't be anywhere near here. Is there like a map of this place that I can? Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Oh, you're crawling. Very interesting. Oh! I did not, I did not like that. I do not like you. There's another one right there. Go ahead, go ahead and do your creepy little, creepy little shit. And then die. All right. Oil urn, what does that do? I have no idea what the, urn that covers target and oil when thrown. So you can combine that with the Molotov cocktail, I assume. It just makes sense. You cover them in oil, then you set them on fire. Man, I can hear them laughing from here. I'd like to file a noise complaint, please. Assholes having party in middle of apocalypse. Is there an enemy? Oh, okay, hey, hey, hey. Here we go, let's get this. Cold blood dew. I'm gonna need to know what that does. Use to gain blood echoes. Let's assign that to a quick item slot. Uh, use to gain blood echoes, okay. Well, I've got 3,000. Is that a lot? I hear somebody walking around up there. Oh, that's a wolf. Okay. Hello? No, I can't talk to you. Okay, so there are animals here. Okay, there's some patrolling doggos that don't look too friendly. Oh my god. Oh my god. I forgot about the counterattack. He killed me. Away! 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 They called me a beast. So am I a werewolf? I gotta go all the way back to the beginning, damn. Okay, so I have a question. Let's say I don't wanna go through the rigmarole of all that crap again. I just want to kind of get back to where I was. Oh. Oh, uh, well I was gonna say, can I just go through this gate? Um, can I hop off or is he just gonna camp? He's just gonna camp. Okay. My first dodge, I think. Let me, let me get your quicksilver. I'm not using the gun nearly enough. I can tell because I'm at max bullets. Oh, hi. 
<laughs> They're freaking out. Oh, that was a big attack. Okay, so when you get close, that's when he does his little stupid little torch attack, right? And he does his little away away thing. Thank you for all that stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna try to get back to where I was. Oh! Okay, check this out. Ooh. I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. I'm out of here. <laughs> so how far do they follow you? Okay. No, no. They can't go any further. That's what I thought. So I kind of cheesed it a bit there. Whoa. What? Okay. All right. Down boy. He's got glowing eyes. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. We can do this. We can do this. Let's go. Let's go, come on. Alright. Not not great. Not great. Oh my god, look at these guys. I tried to use a Molotov cocktail there and it didn't work. There's a guy with the gun up there. How do I God, oh my god. I know you guys are yelling at me right now like, don't use up all your blood vials! You wanna come down? You wanna come down? Okay. Okay, I got one of them. Oh! 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 What? Oh, holy shit! Oh, holy shit! What the fuck? <laughs> Blood Echoes retrieved! Oh, dude, does that mean... Oh... Okay, so when they have glowing eyes, that means that they have your Blood Echoes. Okay, don't get mad at me, but I'm using my last one. That guy... Why did he come over here? I guess he got bored of banging at the door? Well, what's good here is I can go and get this stuff now. Thanks. Torch, okay. Molotov co I got more Molotov cocktails. Dude, he like came up there, why? What a weirdo. What would he possibly have wanted up there? Unfortunately, now he's just like camping the place where I need to go. Cause I need to go up there. And now he's up there for some reason. Look, there he is! Dick! No, don't you do it. I saw you, I saw you aiming your little gun. Okay, what if I just sprint through this? I don't think I have enough. Whoa! Oh, nope, you, nope. Nope, are you serious? I was just gonna try to go up the steps there. Okay, you know what? We had that, were it not for a big stupid ogre thing getting up there. Alright, I'm back to these dudes. I'm trying to cheat a little bit. And I did. I did cheat. And too bad you can't chomp through the fence, huh? He's coming over because he's curious. Oh! Hop off, hop off. Oh my god. Oh! What the fuck? I'm going! I'm going! I'm going! Oh my god. Dude. Fuck off. Uh. Hello. Okay, actual werewolves, not just doggos. Over there. Finally in a new area. I finally made it past that part. 
another bloodstone shard, okay. I did lose some blood echoes, I think, because I think when you lose blood echoes once, you can recover them. But then if you lose them again before recovering your old ones, you don't get the old ones, so you just kind of lose some. And that kind of sucks. Uh, let's go over here for now. Don't really feel like tangoing with two werewolves right now. Hello? Oh, hey. What's this guy? This guy's just hanging off. Pe ten pebbles? You had ten pebbles in your possession. Oh yeah, I basically cleared this whole place out, except for gun guy. And apparently I missed a corpse over there. Damn, that wolf is super big. Can I see that? Yeah, big boy. There's an item over here. Another bloodstone shard, okay. Oh my god. Am I gonna get attacked here? Bloodstone shard, I'd love to be able to use those. <gasps> Dude, I didn't mean. Uh, oh, 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 thank god. Oh, there's a ladder. I don't know if I wanna go down there yet. I haven't decided. What's this? Oh, the ladder actually doesn't really take me anywhere. Um... Oh, actually it does. I just didn't think it did. Okay. Okay, I already know. I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna take these guys down. Oof, there's two of them. Why two? Okay. Hi, I'm, I'm here. Maybe I can, like, peel off one of them. Yeah? Yeah, yeah? Okay, okay. One of them. Not the other one. I don't want to take on two at once. Okay, you are strong! Okay. Nope. I guess I didn't dodge at the right time. I was rolling? They saw me rolling and they were hating. I wasn't actually rolling, I was like, sidestepping, but I wasn't doing it at the right time. I was doing it too early? I think I was doing it too early. Okay. Okay. Alright, so I've cleared this whole area out, and we're getting back up to the bridge with the two werewolves, and I'm still not really sure how to go about this fight. Do I Molotov these guys? I've only got one left, actually. Oops. Oh! Okay, so this is actually great timing. Uh, great segue. I actually was thinking, instead of going against the werewolves, why not come down here? I don't really know what's going on down here. Uh, is there fall damage? Probably not from that height. Probably. What is this thing? Oh, he's a little... This guy's a little tougher. Oh no, don't fall down there. Oh, there's rats. Giant rats. Vermin of unusual size. Okay. A rodents of unusual size. Isn't that what they're called in the Princess Bride? Understand my boomer references. Princess Bride isn't a boomer reference. That's a timeless classic. Hello. So how do you attack? Okay, so you attack like that. You got like a saw blade or... Well... Now you got a dead blade. Oops. That was not a very good burn. Okay, that did not... That didn't do... Oh, you got... You got reach! Okay. Oh, he's got a spear! Dude, there ain't no enemies there. Oh my god. Well, I got him. 
<laughs> we got him, folks. There's a thing over here. Um. So this is a great time and all, but where does this lead exactly? Do I have to go down more? I really wish I had a map. Are there ladders leading down? Oh, oh, there's a ladder right there. Now the question is, do I want to go down there? A lot of big old rats. Precarious walkway. All right. Are they gonna camp the ladder? Don't camp my ladder. I need this. They're camping the ladder. Ow! Ahaha! Ah Ahaha! Ah ah oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit, what is this? Just give me this. What the? That's a lot of blood vials! This has been a great time! Wow. Okay. Good news, they're slow. Hi. So where does this go? Um, do I just fall down or? Oh my god. What is this? It's new equipment, but I don't have I don't have any time! I don't have time! What are you sniffing for? I'm dead! Can't you tell when something's dead? Is your <laughs> But what did I get? I got something good, I think. I'm gonna put it on, if I can. Because thankfully you keep your items every time you die. You just lose all of your blood echoes, your currency, from what I'm, gather uh, I'm gathering. Okay. Let's see. Hunter hat. Hunter garb. So these, physical defense, 50. Black hood, which I currently have, physical defense, 20. So this is better. Use. Do I use? How do I do this? Okay, so instead of the hood, I'd like the hunter hat. It's better in every way. All right, and then foreign garb for hunter garb. That's almost twice as good. Hunter gloves instead of the sullied bandage. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I would imagine that would give you more armor. Oh, look at me. Look at how cool I look now. And I'm stronger, I think. Okay. Whew. Did I get it? Yeah, I got it. Alright, I'm back here. And... It seems like the way down leads to those sewer rats to, this, to these items of clothing right here. Now... I'm wondering how I deal with these guys. Maybe... Do I throw down like an oil urn? And that's how I get him? Or... That's not it. Oh my god. I don't know why... Okay. Okay, no. No, both of you guys are here? No. That's a deal breaker. That's a deal breaker for me. I'm running. Sorry, bud. Can't do it. Can't do it. Oh, there's a big dude. Oh, what? Oh, see? Look, these guys are super strong! These guys are super strong! I'm just gonna leave! <laughs> Oh, oh, you're too big to... Hi. You're too big to go in here, aren't you? Seriously, how the hell do you beat these things? They're crazy strong. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just not gonna mess with you. I'm just gonna leave you... Leave you there. How about how's that sound? Okay. I can't even see them. He's dead now. Where? Okay, you're just gonna have to wait. 
Hello? Anyone else up here? Why are you guys hiding? Yeah. See ya. Wait, he has gun. No, he doesn't. He has a sword. Is there a gun dude in here? Taking a blood vial. Thank you. Thank you. Open door. Does not open from this side. Okay. What about this one? Does this one open? It does. Check that out. But we're not going to go out there just yet because there's more to be seen. Hello there. Hi. Oh! He had a gun! Pungent blood cocktail. I'll, th I'll take that. Thank you very much. When the hunt began, here it is, lore. What I've been searching for for so long. When the hunt began, the healing church left us. Blocking the great bridge to Cathedral Ward as old Yarnum burned to the ground that moonlit night. Okay. They, so there's a church. There's also a place called Old Yarnum. I'm in Central Yarnum right now. Burned to the ground. So they burned the city to the ground. That was a cheap trick you pulled. I thought you were just a harmless old guy in a chair. Um, I should know there's no such thing as harmless in this game, right? No such thing. Up, oh, up. Oh. Okay. I know how to deal with you now. I've had enough practice. Uh, but is it up here? Ooh. Bloodstone shard. I would love to know how to use those. <gasps> Dude. Hell yes! A shortcut, this is where we started! Let's go to the Hunter's Dream. Cause you know what? I'm ready to take a break, a brief respite from all the bloodshed. And we'll see if we can't like buy something. Crow feather garb, attire worn by Eileen the Crow, Hunter of Hunters. Very neat. And I feel right at home amongst the groans of whatever the hell these things are. <laughs> All right, we gotta go check out the bath messenger. He's in the hot tub, he's ready to take our money, and I'm ready to give it to him. <coughs> okay, so we can buy 12 blood vials, or, oh, we can buy one blood vial for 180 a piece, and there's 12 in stock. We don't need that, though, we've got 12 already. Um, let's see, key items. You don't sell any weapons. Yarnum Hunter. Okay. Is this stuff... Can I... Can I compare these? To what I already have? Or do I already have these? They're just called Hunter. It's just Hunter Hat. Hunter Garb. 110, 110, 80, 110, 40, 110, 70. Let's see if it's any better. 110, 80, 90, 90, 80, 190. So actually, the stuff that I have on is better than all this crap. It's not crap, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to insult your wares, bath messenger. But the stuff that I have that I found in the sewers is better than this stuff. So I don't need to buy that. And there's really nothing else for me to get with the blood echoes, weirdly. Uh, Let's buy some Molotov cocktails then, I guess. Sure, and I mean, while we're at it, might as well buy some of these, I guess. I probably should have checked to see if there was anything else I could buy. <laughs> I could buy with blood echoes. I'm not sure what else you could do with them. All right, um, I guess I'll go back to Central Yarnum now, and we'll see where we can go with our new path. Two and a half hours, okay. Sorry, I was just looking at uh, how long I've been recording. Two and a half hours, apparently. Sorry, did you have something for me? A blood vial? I got that one for free. Nice. Okay, so this is the way that we go now. Oh. Big guys. Alright. Huh. 
Now, this is a good time as any to fight these dudes, I guess. I'm gonna have to learn how to do it at some point. So what do you do? That. Okay. Oh, ow. That's a... Hey, you're not that bad. You're not so bad. And I'm maxed out on blood vials. Yeah, you're not so bad, honestly. Let's see if your buddy's the same. It seems like the same... Oh, wow. Okay. What's that? Why does he have that... thing on him? Shining coins. What does that do? Are we okay? Assorted shining coins which might guide one's way. Well, I guess I'll put it... on the quick items. Alright. Use one of my 20 blood vials. Oof. Do we go up here? Hi. It is I. Um, the one that everyone hates. Oh! This is the door that, oh, could only be opened from one side. Alright. Yeah, the, the... The old guy assassin over there is lying in wait. Where's this? Wait! No, 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 sorry, I thought I knew where I was, but I don't. Oh my god. Uh, can you guys break out of that? You know what? I'm just gonna make sure that you guys don't surprise me later. Oh, oh, oh! Look, one of them broke out. One of them broke out. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. You want tango? Okay. I was supposed to dodge that, see? That's not what was supposed to happen. I hate doing this, but... I'm like... Just so you guys know, I don't like doing this, but I have to, you see? Hello? It is you. What are you barking at? Yeah. No. I mean, you seem pretty safe. I've heard I have. Shutting up indoors isn't always enough. Well, if he wants to stop your asses, he wouldn't be in this mess. You're obligated to help me, you hear? So what will it be? Are you going to tell me you're not? Look. No. Okay. Yeah, I should have known. You stood for nothing. No respect for the elderly is what that is. That little good you outsiders do. Go on. Admit it. You think we're all mad, don't you? Well, go and stop it. I know all your tricks. You're kind of talking to a brick wall right now, lady. Uh, could I have said anything else other than no there? I feel like the answer was no. Oh, who's hiding? Okay, come on out. Where are you hiding? Bad guys? Hmm. Okay, uh, I don't know. Oh, hello. I've tangled with your kind before. Come on, just go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Go make my day. Oh, he had a second attack. All right, all right. But then after the second attack, he's done. In more ways than one. Okay, bloodstone shard. Oh yeah, where do I do? Anything with that, I would love to use that. Uh, 
Hello. Hey. Get back to work. No slacking off, okay? That's right. Well, he won't be slacking off anymore. <laughs> oh, hi! Oh, you think this is cute, huh? Wait, am I back in the sewer area? Are there rats down there? There are! There are rats! Cold blood dew. Okay. So that's just like back loaded blood echoes whenever I want them, right? What is this? Okay, so there's a ladder here. This isn't the same ladder that I went down earlier. These gun guys are everywhere. Excuse me. Whew. They're still shooting at me from over there. Holy shit. You guys don't scare me anymore. Go ahead, take another shot. That's a wall, idiot. Oh, Lord Sadler. I keep expecting them to say that. Played too much Resident Evil 4. Or I've played Resident Evil 4 too many times, rather. Oh, no. Oh, you still got me. Oh, you know what? Fuck this. Oh, nope, that's the... I didn't do it right. Right here. I don't like your little flippy flappy jump scares. Ugh. Why can't they fly? Well, they. Oh! You were. You were hiding back there. I hate you. So, what is all this? Oh, there's like a big ol'. Look at this. Big ol' ladder right here. Do I. Okay. What is. Ow, so there is fall damage. Ouch. Do these guys all come to life, or...? Well, first of all, what's up here? What's at the top of the long ladder? That's what I'm gonna check first. Oh my god, this couldn't take longer if he tried. Look, there's another long ladder up there. Oh, it's one of those big guys. Oh, what? No, no more crows. Just get it over with. All right, what were you guarding? Madman's knowledge. I heard from the loading screen that this grants me insight. Which, what's, what's insight? Skull of an Enlightened Man used to gain insight. I guess I'll just hoard it for now because I'm not sure what it does. Oop, nope, okay. Oh, did you get dizzy? Two blood vials, okay. Hey, there's a light under this door. I was just saying hi. You got the wrong idea. <laughs> I was just saying hi. Damn. Oh, wait. This also goes up. Well. Oh, this doesn't open. I thought maybe that opened. Where am I going right now? Oh, oh, this. Could this be a shortcut of some kind? Closed by a device. Oh, this is, I need to stop freaking out every time I see that. <laughs> It's just this. This opens it up. Open a little faster, thank you. 
Oh! It's another shortcut that we just opened. Oh, because that is the same... This is the same party with all the cackling. That makes sense now. So once you open up a shortcut, it's just permanently open, right? Okay, I'm back to these guys. <sighs> all right, I'm just gonna try to book it again. Hello. Hello, friends. Oh my god. Oh, because I haven't been over here yet. All right, that's what I thought. Oh wait, oh, the werewolves are still coming. Jeez, they're persistent. Oh, it's the cleric beast. Okay, this is the first boss battle. I'm gonna die. No, move. Oh my god. Move! Okay, bad. Bad. Okay. He's moving slow. Oh my god. Well, that is fun. I missed. That's a- Okay, he tried to go for the grab. Man, I should be careful not to use up all my blood vials here. Okay, I need to learn the patterns. That's a big one. Can I attack his hand when he puts it down? You got me. Oh my god, and you killed me. Just like that. <sighs> so... I have beaten this boss before. But it was in 2015, so I can't remember anything about it. Uh, that was a, That's a cool appearance, though, how he just kind of appears behind the building like that. Hmm. Oh! Hello? Hello, good hunter. I am a doll. Here in this dream to look after you. Honorable hunter, pursue the echoes of blood. And I will channel them into your strength. You will hunt beasts, and I will be here for you to embolden your sickly spirit. Very well. Let the echoes become your strength. Let me stand close. Now shut your eyes. I have zero blood echoes. Okay, so you can use blood echoes to raise your stats. Why did I waste all of mine earlier? I didn't. Well, I didn't have this option available. Yeah, I don't have any. I don't have anything for you, lady. Talk. Did you speak with Gammon? Who's that? He was a hunter long, long ago but now serves only to advise them. He is obscure, unseen in the dreaming world. Still, he stays here, in this dream. Such is his purpose. Great. Where Farewell, is he? Farewell, good hunter. Yeah, I knew, I knew. May you it. find your worth in the waking world. I, I thought it said wanking world for a second, and I was going to ask some questions about that. Consume insight and ring the beckoning bell to enlist the cooperation of hunters from other worlds. Silencing blank in such form of cooperation. Oh! So is that what you use insight for? Is that the eye in the upper right? You use insight to bring other players in for co-op? Or am I just... Misinterpreting that. Okay. Well, guys. It's been fun. Has it? I hope so. Otherwise, what's the point of all this? It's been fun. But uh, that is going to draw 
Bloodborne Part 1 to a close. I know probably some people were like, Oh, he's gonna beat the Clerk Beast in Part 1! And he's gonna beat Father Gascoigne in Part 2, and then in Part 3 he's gonna beat the third boss. Whoever that- I don't know who that is. Um... Yeah, but... I think it's gonna be a little slower going than that. But, I am dedicated to this for the long haul. Assuming that we're all having fun. So... Yeah, um... Nothing really, like, poignant or insightful to say here at the end about the game. I mean, this is- I- It's all coming back to me now, from when I played this years and years ago. Um, for a few hours, and, uh... Yeah, like, I'm not, like, really getting into it yet, but we've barely scratched the surface, so... I'm hoping to get more into it as the game goes on. Hope I see you in part two. Uh, if you're down for the whole series, I'm gonna put a playlist in the description where you can follow along with all the videos uh, as they are uploaded. But yeah, I can't think of anything else to say. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Think critically.